Hello everyone, I am Dattatra Nikam. Welcome you all on our channel eFunda for new day, new topic. And our today's topic is Understanding of Electrical Symbols Part 24A. As you know that we have already started a separate playlist for electrical engineering and their detail design related topics. As part of this, we are today taking you to the symbols of the electrical discipline as it is a critical to understand the various deliverables related to the electrical engineering and if you are new to our channel then please visit to our channel eFunda and watch all the videos created related to the various topics and segregated under separate playlist which you can see there and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and press bell icon to get the latest notification on upload of our new video on our channel eFunda. Also, we have created option for the membership so that you can get our the videos first to you. The notification of our videos will come to you and this membership comes with a lot of other benefits which you can avail by pressing the join button and enjoy the feature of our membership. So let's begin with our today's topic that understanding of electrical symbols part 24a. Importance of electrical symbol and legend as electrical symbols are a graphical representation of a basic electrical and electronic devices or a component. These symbols are used in circuits and electrical diagrams to recognize a component. It is also called as a schematic symbol. One can refer to the picture where you can see the schematic diagram with various symbols and sometimes it may be difficult to identify each and every sim symbol without your experience. So this topic will be helpful for you to understand different types of symbols are being used in electrical discipline. The schematic diagram use standardized symbol to represent different electrical components like resistor, capacitors, inductor, switches and uh, power sources. They are used both in designing and uh, troubleshooting electrical circuit such as those in appliances, industrial machineries or electronic devices etc. A schematic shows the plan and function for an electrical circuit but it is not concerned with physical layouts of the any of these wires. Maybe wiring diagram, it will show how the wires are being connected to the various devices where they should be located in actual devices as well as in the physical connections of all the component. So to understand this better schematic diagram and wiring diagram and various other deliverables of electrical discipline, it is very important to understand electrical symbols and the legends and for today's topic the topic courtesy by DOV fundamentals handbook for electrical engineering symbols prints and drawing understanding of electrical symbols now we are seeing the transformer to read and interpret electrical diagram and a schematic reader must first be well versed in what many symbol represent. This section discusses the common symbols used to depict the many components in electrical systems. Once mastered this, then this knowledge should be enable the reader to successfully understand most electrical diagrams and schematic. Now transformer symbol, the basic symbol used for the various types of transformers are shown in figure below A and B where the basic symbol for the transformer is modified to represent specific type and a transformer application. In addition to the transformer symbol itself, polarity also makes an mark are sometimes used to indicate the current flow in the circuit. This information can be used to determine the phase relationship that is a polarity between the input and output terminals of the transformer. The marks usually appear as a dots 
on the transformer symbol shown in other figure below on the primary side of the transformer the dot indicates the current in on the secondary side the dot indicates current out if at a given instant the current is flowing into the transformer at the dotted end of the primary coil then it will be flowing out of the transformer at the dotted end of the secondary coil the current flow for transformer is being used the dot symbol is illustrated as in shown in a figure or example to one can see here for the transformer symbols there is a single phase tapped then adjustable iron core or a three phase transformers are being shown as a transformer symbol whereas the modified that is a three phase wye ungrounded symbols you can see then three phase delta symbols you can also see for the transformer then three phase wye grounded where the grounding is shown additionally then the potential and the current are also refer or indicated in terms of the symbology this is how it will help you to understand various types of the transformer symbols are being used in electrical discipline understanding of electrical symbol that is a switches the term pole is used to describe the switches shown in figure below one can refer the figure where the number of point at which the current can enter a switch here the single pole and double pole switches are shown but a switch may have as many as poles as it require to perform the function the term throw used in figure refers to the number of circuit that each pole of a switch can complete or control at the functionality here you can see sp st sp dt sp dt these are the three types of the symbol s s2 and s3 are being used then for double pole double through that is a dp dt indicated by two lines and then functionality also the push button normally open push button normally close then the push button two position switch that is a nc no combination of no and nc shown above then multi position switch where the multi position switch are available maybe one can consider as a regulator of the fan for controlling the speed and increasing and decreasing can occur simultaneously as you move on the switch position understanding of electrical symbols for automatic function switches the common symbol that are used to denote automatic switches and explain how the symbols indicated for the switch status or actuation please refer below the table or a figure where the various kinds of symbols are indicated starting from the first that is a limit switches direct actuated spring return normally open normally open held close normally close normally close held open this is opposite to the open one then open switch with a time delay closing tdc feature close switch with a time delay opening tdo feature open switch with time delay opening tdo feature both symbols are shown close switch with a time delay closing tdc feature and then flow actuated switch closing on increase of the flow when the flow is increased then it will go up then the opening on increase in the flow once the flow has increased then switch will get open then the liquid level actuated switch closing on rising of the level this is similar in terms of the flow type functionality but it is for the purpose of the level then opening on a rising of the level similar to the one which we have show for flow pressure or a vacuum actuated switch closing on rising the pressure similar to flow and level opening on rising pressure similar to flow and level which we have shown just above then the temperature actuated switch 
closing on the rising of the temperature that is a IEC or it's similar to the function of the level and flow which we have seen this is how the automatic functionality switches are there to indicate some specific action based on either on or off status or open and a closed status either on a flow or a level or a pressure or the temperature on the various parameter functionality understanding of electrical symbols that is a fuse and circuit breaker basic fuse and a circuit breaker symbols for single phase applications then most of the drawing will also provide the rating of the fuse next to the symbol of the fuse which are used in there then the rating is usually in terms of ampere one can refer to the pictorial view where you can see the plug fuse and you can see the symbol a ribbon fuse then knife fuse and you can see the symbol in addition to that you can see the thermal circuit breaker pictorial view you can see and the symbol you can see the breaker symbol shown open then the thermal device symbols is also shown and then you can see in a third picture where the magnetic type circuit breaker you can see the pictorial view as well as the symbol the breaker symbol shown for the closed circuit as well as the magnetic device symbols are shown this is how the devices of the fuse and circuit breaker are being used to protect our equipment or devices that is the reason actually the rating of each fuse is important based on the application that is the reason all the drawing indicated the fuse symbol along with their ratings understanding of electrical symbol three phase and removable breaker when fuses breaker or switches are used in three phase system then the three phase symbol combines the single phase symbol in a triplicate manner as shown in a below figure one can refer how three phase breaker is shown with the three symbols also shown in the symbol for a removable breaker which is a standard breaker symbol placed between set of chevrons and the chevron represents the point at which the breaker disconnects from the circuit when it is removed as you can see how the triplicate symbols of the three phase removable breakers are shown where the, the disconnection is shown in the figure this is how the three phase and removable breakers are shown in electrical systems understanding of electrical symbol that is a common electrical component symbols the common symbols for relay contact connectors line resistor and other miscellaneous electrical components can be seen from the below picture where the relay contacts connector transmission line resistance and miscellaneous item symbols are indicated it is very important to understand these symbols as mainly the relay contacts are being used in the logic where we are implementing any of the function for automation that is the time where we can use the basic contact type and those are indicated by a symbol as well as a and b type contact make and the above details are mentioned simultaneously the transfer contact as well as the time delay contacts and the sequential contacts are being shown as well similarly the connectors are shown female male connector as well as the separable connector that is a engage one are shown the transmission line conductive path two conductors three conductors path crossing path junction are also shown the resistance that resistors taped resistor then rheostat potentiometer various different types of resistance are shown with the symbol then the miscellaneous symbols including the circuit ground capacitor chassis ground inductor thermocouple lamp or voltmeter ammeter ohmmeter etc as this symbol plays a major role while doing the detail and design engineering in the field of electrical discipline so it is better to understand these symbols very correctly so that the application or implementation in detail and design engineering can be easily done 
understanding of electrical symbols for the large components below figures are used to identify the larger component and that may found in an electrical diagram or a schematic diagram the detail use for this type of symbols will vary when the use in the system diagram usually the amount of the details will reflect in the relative importance of a component to that particular diagram the application based symbols may vary one can see the symbols for motor batteries are shown starting from motor that is mot or m into the circle generator single phase double phase three phase wye grounded connections as well as the alternative symbols are also shown three phase wye ungrounded connection and alternative options are also shown then three phase detail that is a alternative also shown and the batteries that is a single cell battery plus minus or positive negative symbols multiple cell battery connected in series are also shown this is how the detail symbols are used for the larger component when we are doing the designing or planning any particular electrical diagram this symbol will always help you to make your application easy and understandable for the particularly in the implementation phase that is the reason understanding of a electrical symbol is a very critical in subject of electrical discipline as this symbols will always help you to complete the application complete the logic and ensure that implementation is successful to run your electrical applications with this we are concluding on our today's topic thanks for watching our channel e funda where you will get to know the fundamentals so that is our tagline get your fundamentals right where we do identify the needs then we evaluate the need then define plan for a particular need and then accordingly execute the plan this is what we are creating our technical videos so that it will help every individual to get their fundamentals right and if you are new to our channel then subscribe to our channel and don't forget to press bell icon to get the latest notification on upload of our new video on our channel e funda also you can follow us on our instagram page and do follow our facebook page as well so keep watching our channel e funda for new day new topic